what's up guys i know based on the title of this video you guys clearly know what i will be talking about and that is my blogging setup yeah. but before we start if you haven't already subscribed to my youtube ch channel make sure you subscribe and hit the like button on my like button on my previous video um because i will be continuously Posting up videos of blogging and possibly a little bit of tech, not a huge, not a lot because I'm not a huge um, person on tech and stuff like that. But like I said, subscribe and we'll continue with the video. Now, if you watched my other video, you will know that exactly what camera I'm using now instead of like my phone. This is my phone right now, but it's only because i need to film something i um, obviously can't use my camera to show you guys which is my vlogging camera but um basically um a lot of my previous videos i use just my phone which i think works really good even though if like you don't have any uh, money to spend um, on camera gear i highly recommend the new iphone 7 um phones for vlogging because like how i said i was using that for a lot of my previous videos or most of my videos and i feel like they came out like really good quality and uh the sound was okay it wasn't too bad um but for the most part you could literally vlog with your phone and it'll be fine okay now to get started so basically i'm gonna start with the road mic that i'm using right now for my computer i mean my computer what, the heck? what? bro what are you talking about man my camera and the reason being is because I swear that like the audio is probably the most important thing that you need in your videos when you're um, posting videos on YouTube no nobody really like thinks about it like oh the quality has to be perfect but the audio is alright actually I feel like the audio is way more important than the quality of the video like obviously the quality of the video is important also so basically the road mic that I use is a video micro um, road mic. This video micro is a compact microphone designed to improve the audio quality of your video. It incorporates a high quality cardio cardioid condenser microphone capsule for great quality audio recordings when used with wide range of cameras. So basically, you could use this odd, um, road mic on a lot of cameras, not just the one that I'm using. So basically, this is the road video micro that I use. As you can see, it's pretty damn small. It's not that not that big. So when you're in public, you don't feel as awkward as if you were using the Rode Pro or something like that. So this one's pretty small. Uh, I really like it so far. I haven't tried the other ones, so I can't get my review on those. But like how I said, this one's pretty good. I like it. It's cool because it even comes with this little fluffy thing. And that is so that like when you're outside and it's windy, um, basically you won't be able to hear any of that sound because you just pretty much plug it in through the hole right here. And you just go like that. Make sure you attach it good because you don't want to fall it off or something. Basically you just put it like that and there you just connect this to your audio put on your camera and it'll be functioning you don't need no batteries or anything like that because it is grabbing power from your camera battery obviously and yeah it's pretty compact very small um works perfectly fine for me i haven't tried the other ones like how i, I was saying but i like this one so far and if you were curious to know what box or how does the box look like when you buy it and it looks exactly like this all right so if you go to best buy i'm sure you could buy one for like 60 dollars or go on amazon and buy it for um i think it was i think i paid about 63 dollars after taxes and stuff like that so like how i said this is a compact uh, little microphone that you could put on top of your camera and it works perfectly fine i really like it so far now to talk about the camera that i'm using at the moment so basically what i'm using right now is a canon 70d right there you guys can see it 
and I really like this camera so far. I've only had it for a few months now, or possibly even like a little bit less, no, probably like two months now, but I barely started using it because I had to get a road mic and stuff like that for it. So basically, I'm not gonna get like too technical with this, but I really like the autofocus on it. If I, like if I'm filming and stuff like that, my videos, um, the autofocus is really, really good. Also, another thing that I really like about it is this flip out screen. This right here is so useful because when you're obviously vlogging, you wanna be able to see yourself and be able to see that you are in the little square of your camera in between here. So basically, I really like that. And knowing that I could close it like that, you know, so it doesn't scratch or anything like that. So you just go at that and you open it and you can see it. I like how it's also touch screen. So not to um, like use any of these buttons if you don't want to, because like how I said, it is touch screen. So that's about it for this uh, camera. I wish I could give more information, but I am not someone that is certified to be given all that information because I don't even know how to use all the features on this camera yet, but I am still learning. Okay, now let's move on to the lens that I use at the moment. So this lens is a 18 to 135 millimeter lens. Basically, this lens is okay to start with. I mean, this is the lens that I came with when I bought the camera. So that's obviously what I'm gonna be using at the moment. I highly recommend buying a wide angle lens, like the 10 to 18 millimeter, millimeter lens. I feel like it's better to have a wide angle, wide range in your videos than like, than like being like this the whole time in your videos. Obviously people wanna see your surroundings and what you're doing. And this one's fine, you know, just to start off. But I mean, it gets the job done. It does take very far pictures because it zooms in pretty damn far, if you guys could tell by that. The length of this, like that, like that, like that, like that. Yeah, so basically you guys get the point. But like how I said, it's a good lens still. I'm eventually gonna move up to a wide angle lens. I just need to save up the, the money for it. And yeah, okay, and last but not least, here is my, Joby tripod. I know there's a ton of vloggers that use this or the other one that costs like $100. This one only costed $45 on Amazon. That's not including Texas. Um, but honestly, it's so useful because whenever you're vlogging and stuff, you wanna be able to have a good grip on your camera and at a kind of far distance. So I really like it. I just started using it. Um, Definitely a great investment because how I said you don't want to be walking around holding your camera through this little Through this little grip right here if you could just better off just Screwing it on which is very very easy So basically you could be like this And you could keep it at a distance. So it's honestly something you should probably think about buying if you're gonna be vlogging um, or daily vlogging or anything like that um, definitely useful now this camera is heavy just so you guys know it weighs probably about like I'm not even sure to be honest but um, yeah it's uh, definitely a good investment you should definitely buy this it's better like when you're carrying it around just holding it from like this or anything you know and it's quick when you're vlogging so that you could like flip out to the next person that's in front of you like you could be like this and then you go back bam quick or I mean like this with the camera out and you go bam you know pretty cool I like it okay and once you already put everything all together this is how it will be looking like Yeah, that's pretty much it. 
Um, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you hit a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And um, probably my next video will be a normal vlog. It probably won't be another tech one because I don't have any uh, cool little gadgets besides besides a drone um, Phantom 4. But that's like not that important. But if you guys like this video, make sure you hit a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe.